In our search for the best French press of 2021, we screened dozens of models, selecting the 12 most promising for in-house testing. Our coffee experts evaluated each product on four key grounds, filtration, ease of use, ease of cleaning, and durability. Our selections span a variety of styles and sizes although the results of our analysis are organized such that making direct, side-by-side -side comparisons are as easy as a Sunday morning. The first product on our list is Coffee Gator Insulated. The Coffee Gator Insulated Press topped the charts in every one of our metrics. It produced a nearly sediment-free cup, a surprise, considering the typically notoriously muddy brew of pressed coffee. This outcome is in large part the result of the double mesh filters tacked on the business end of the unit's plunger. Further minimizing sediment pass-through is the well-matched carafe slash plunger assembly that traps the grounds without limiting the plunger's ease of movement. When the coffee is drained, cleaning the coffee gator is a snap. Simply toss out the grounds and pop it in the dishwasher. Although the gator is easy to clean, you can't wash off ugly. And, while we think it's what comes out of the spout that counts, this unit's outward appearance may not be to everyone's liking. The Gator sports modern industrial styling that speaks to utility over aesthetics. With that in mind, this press's all-metal construction makes it nearly indestructible and, thus, well-suited to busy kitchens and campsites alike. The next product on our list is Polivia Double Wool 34 Ounce. First and foremost, the Polivia brews a wonderfully clean cup of Java, thus eliminating the main criticism leveled at the press extraction method. As with other models that can back up such a claim, this achievement is the product of the tight tolerance maintained between plunger and carafe as well as the employment of redundant mesh filters. Utility aside, the Polivia's design captures a more timeless look that may earn it a permanent place on the countertop. We appreciate the mottled exterior of the metal carafe and the oiled teak fixtures. While the wood adornments are undeniably a nice touch, they do require hand washing, this piece will need to stay out of the dishwasher for longevity's sake. Wood is a less durable material in general, meaning drops landing handle first could prove to be costly. These caveats aside, this press is more than sturdy enough for most kitchens. We also found the speckled exterior to be a nice choice as it prevents the unsightly smudges produced when handling glass or polished metal presses. The next product in our list is Moula French Press Double Insulated. The luxurious polished, stainless steel exterior of the Moula belies its modest cost. More than just a looker, this press hammers home its favorable cost-to-quality ratio with double mesh filters well fitted to an insulated carafe. The result is a gratifyingly clean brew that will maintain its warmth long enough for a top-off or two. After the coffee is drained, simply rinse out the grounds and place it in the dishwasher. All told, the Mueller's easy-to-use design and durable construction make it an easy choice regardless of one's budget. While the Mueller's design is certainly sturdy and easy to maintain, its mirror-like finish readily shows greasy smudges and splatterings, which mars its aesthetic appeal. Additionally, while the filtration is good, it is not as thorough as some of the other models in this review. Yet, if you're looking to plunge into a better coffee experience without having to take a financial bath to do so, this is a great option. The next product in our list is Stanley Classic Vacuum Insulated French Press. With a whopping 48-ounce capacity, the Stanley easily creamed the competition and earned the designation as the leading large-capacity press. How much bigger is it? Where standard-sized units are limited to about three mugs of Joe, the Stanley filled four with some to spare for top-offs and warm-ups. Speaking of top-offs, this coffee maker's all-metal construction is the proverbial cherry on the cake as it is durable and dishwasher safe. Given the plus-size carafe and the built-to-last design, we believe this unit's performance more than justifies its relatively high cost. Although there is much to praise the Stanley Press for, it is certainly not without its shortcomings. For example, its lid fits somewhat loosely, allowing the plunger to wobble when pressed down. We were also less than impressed with the spout design as it did little to rein in the rate of discharge. While these concerns could easily be overlooked, 
the relatively poor filtration provided by the double filters stuck in our crawl. Still, if you need a high volume pressing capacity, the Stanley leads the pack. And, with a carafe that size, one can spare a little coffee in the bottom to hold the dregs. The next product is Vecan French Press. Size isn't everything. Case in point, the Vecan carved out a place for itself as a miniaturized version of a classic press design. Specifically, the Vecan is a 12-ounce, single-serving unit comprised of a glass carafe cradled in a stainless steel frame with a lid slash plunger assembly to match. The unit is dishwasher safe, includes a pair of extra filter screens, and is quite affordable. Admittedly, we were drawn to the Vecan as it appeals to our minimalist instincts and ritualized daily coffee quaffing. However, this model's filtration isn't as complete as we have observed in other presses in the group. It produces a somewhat gritty brew, especially if you overload it with grounds or rush the plunger. The metal frame also provides gaps where residue can build up, so it will likely need to be removed from time to time for a thorough cleaning. That said, if you're a one cup a day kind of Java drinker, this unit is worth a gander. The next product is Sterling Pro Double Wall Large. In overall scoring, the Sterling Pro is a leader. It offers a double filter that generates better than average filtration, yielding a nearly sediment-free brew. The unit also boasts double wall insulation to keep the exterior cool while maintaining the warmth of the contents. The fully stainless construction makes cleanup easy as it is machine washable. When it's time for a deep clean, the plunger assembly easily comes apart and back together. Given such a claim, one may be wondering at the relatively low ranking this press received. This result is a consequence of the Sterling Pro's relatively minor filtration and cleaning shortfalls. First of all, the edges of the filter do not fold over. As a result, the filters permit a bit more flex, which allows more sediment to pass by the plunger. As for cleaning, we found it hard to maintain the out-of-the-box shine that makes this model so visually appealing. Still, when taken as a whole, the Sterling Pro is a top-notch press that is both durable and effective at making a praiseworthy cup of joe. The next product in our list is Freeling Double Wall. The Freeling Double Wall French press delivered an excellent performance in all of our tests. This model has that solid feel that speaks to the quality of its construction. The Freeling filters grounds using a pair of stacked mesh screens, with the upper being finer and slightly smaller in diameter than the lower. Happily, this unusual design produces a brew far cleaner than average, though it's not perfect. However, the quality of the filtration may have more to do with the plunger being well fitted to the carafe, a feature that is evidenced in the tight fit and smooth action of the plunger. Finally, the stainless steel construction allows for machine washing once the dregs are removed. While the freeling is certainly easy to operate and maintain, it fell short of the leaders in a minor but notable way. Specifically, the use of a recessed secondary filter reduces the stiffness of the outer edge of the plunger. Although this contributes to easier depression of the plunger, it allows small amounts of grounds to work their way around the filter as it slides down the carafe. The result is a slightly muddier brew as compared to the higher scoring models. For a product that slightly misses the mark in this key metric, we found the Freeling's hefty price tagged to be a bit out of proportion. With that said, if one has a budget to match, this stylish press isn't likely to disappoint those looking for a bolder tactile richness in a cup of java. The next product in our list is Secura 304 grade stainless steel insulated. The double walled, polished stainless steel Secura has the look and feel of a solidly constructed press. This impression is supported by the well-fitted plunger and its dishwasher safe status. While the unit only uses a single mesh filter to strain out grounds and sediment, it does have the advantage of a doubled over edge on that filter. The quality of the filter combined with the tight carafe slash plunger tolerance produces better filtration than most single filter models. The press also comes with two spare filters, which can be added to the plunger to increase filtration or set aside as replacements. The Secura scored well in most metrics but came up short in our filtration tests as it was competing with double filter models. 
While the purity of the brew could be improved by adding one of its extra filters, we chose to test it right out of the box, as many consumers don't like to fiddle around with a brand new purchase. Aside from the filter, the only other downside is that the Secura's polished stainless steel shows the grease smudges from every hand that touches it, making it difficult to maintain the mirror-like finish. Overall, this product remains a good choice for someone who likes the look of polished steel and is disciplined enough to keep their hand on the handle. The next product in our list is Café du Chateau. The Café du Chateau press is a modern take on a classic design. The unit has a traditional glass carafe, however, the polished stainless steel frame supporting the glass has the look of a low-cut collar. We'll leave it to the reader to decide if this model's décolletage is pleasing to the eye. Moving on to more practical matters, this model filters well, which is the result of its twin-folded edge filters. Yet, apart from the curvy polished steel frame, this press lacks distinction. As with all the polished steel models in our review, the Café du Chateau's finish is hard to maintain, and it readily shows fingerprints. Additionally, the frame forms a pocket wherein residue may build up, thus increasing the cleaning burden. However, it's dishwasher safe and comes with a couple of extra filters. When you strip away all of this unit's garnishments, it is simply a decent double filter press at a reasonable price. The next product is Bodum Brazil 34 ounce. The Bodum Brazil is one of the least expensive presses in our review. This coffee maker features the humdrum, though adequate, performance that we have come to expect from Bodum. The glass carafe and polypropylene frame are dishwasher safe, easy to disassemble, and are relatively durable. While we prefer simple designs, the basic Brazil leaves out some key features to achieve this end. Most significantly, it only utilizes a single filter, and the screen on this filter has an open edge. The spring supporting the filter screen overlaps where it meets, creating a weakness that allows grounds to pass through. Despite these issues, we think the Brazil is appropriately priced and would be a good choice for the less discerning coffee drinker who'd like to save a buck. The next product in our list is Bowdoin Chambord 1 Liter. When many people think of a press, an image of something akin to the Bodum Chambord likely comes to mind. Whether one agrees with this statement or not, it is undeniable that this model has been a staple in kitchens and coffee shops for many years. This product is simple to use, and as long as everything goes to plan, equally easy to clean and maintain. Coffee drinkers who love a more heavy body, tactile experience will find the Chambord to be quite satisfactory. Tradition aside, when compared to contemporary press designs, the Chambord falters in a number of areas. First and foremost is filtration. This coffee maker puts out a muddy cup, and while many drinkers will expect that from this extraction method, it doesn't have to be that way. Another issue is that the glass carafe is not securely restrained by the metal frame and can slide out when emptying spent grounds. Given the unit's propensity for unannounced aerial displays, it's not surprising that the manufacturer sells replacement carafes and other parts. The next product is Le Creuset Stoneware Coffee Maker. The Le Creuset French press catches the eye wherever it sits. This gorgeous kitchen staple features the brand's signature enamel coating and comes in many colors to complement your decor or existing collection. The Le Creuset press is stain resistant, and if properly cared for, it could become. Thanks for watching and hope you liked it. As always, all the links about the products will be in the description below. So if you want to find the best prices, and more information that we might not get a chance to mention in the video, be sure to check them out.